this is the 3D Cam introduction video. So I've started 3D Cam from the uh, desktop, and this is the screen which I'm presented with. The first choice I have to make is the units I want to work in, either inches or metric. Um, having set the units, they will become the default the next time I start the system. If I need to change the units at any time, I go to the options, view options window here and I can set the units. They haven't changed because I haven't restarted the system since the first time I came in. The screen layout is across the top we have the ribbon toolbars so this is the file menu, this is the geometry where we can create 2D geometry and also this is where we manipulate the geometry or the models and uh, these are the snapping options here. The solids window allows us to create uh, primitives or extrude or revolve a sketch. The view menu here gives us the option of viewing the model and the toolpath in various ways, zooming in and out, etc. And over here we have the option of switching windows on and off. The milling toolbar here contains all the commands for creating milling programs. The rest of the screen layout is, on the left hand side here we have the objects tree window. In here will be any tools that are defined, any surfaces and machining operations. The options window here is to do with setting system options. The properties window here is to show the properties of an item selected from the objects tree window. The rest of the screen is devoted to the graphics uh, area and we have a message box. The message box is displayed at the top of the screen but if we click and drag hold of that we can position it somewhere else. So I normally like it to be the bottom right hand corner here but at any time you can always move this message box to suit you or your screen resolution or your preferred layout. So that's the introduction to the screen layout and setting the units for 3D CAM.